You know what's a funny thing about life? You can choose how you want to live it, and I'm not saying that this person is living life incorrectly, but there's definitely a right and wrong way to live life. Now before I get into this video and start showing you how disgusting this guy's fucking room is, I want to give a little discretion that I'm not hating on this dude, it's just I want to bring to light how fucking gross this is. <laughs> I spend a lot of time on TikTok as everyone does, I probably spend like, I don't know, like 12 out of the 14 hours that I'm awake on TikTok. It's not serious, don't take that serious please. And I'm not gonna I hate on him because I could definitely say that you know sometimes my room does get dirty like as of right now I probably have like 12 water bottles sitting on my fucking desk and that's not a lie I could grab one right now Now it's a good thing this video isn't about me, it's about this guy that I found on TikTok. He's not extremely popular, so it's fine if you don't really know him. I found him yesterday, and I felt the need to just make a video on it because this is horrendous. Part of his content on TikTok is just making videos of him cleaning out cockroaches from his room, or just cleaning his room because he has a girl coming over, or just cleaning his room in general. I don't know how it keeps getting so dirty once he cleans it, but that's a different story for a different day, I guess. Now I scrolled through this guy's TikTok for two to three hours to try and find the uh, best examples of his room being a biohazard. Uh, the first example that I keep finding is him uh, showing us his cockroaches. Clearing off my desk so that roaches stop bothering me while I'm playing games. Okay, immediately within the first two seconds of this video even starting, we can see how much of a fucking mess this guy's room is. How do you, where do you, where do you sleep? As you know, my room's been a little messy lately. And I found out that I need a trash bag because I was trying to play a league and I found a roach on my desk. And now this roach, I wasn't even able to find it because it got away. Now I couldn't throw away these drinks because they were still pretty much full. Um, I'm just gonna drink them like and finish them. What do you mean your room is a little messy? When my room is a little messy, that means there's like a handful of water bottles like on my desk. Like I can I can walk around my room safely and not have to worry about cockroaches. This dude said he found a cockroach on his desk and he lost it. Burned the house down. He also started picking up the drinks like nothing. Um the cockroach is probably in there. He found a home. He has a new house. It's in that Dr. Pepper can. Anyway, just so you guys know, SpaghettiOs do not last very good if left out. It made my room smell like SpaghettiOs. Not very appetizing. Okay, thank God he gave me this useful piece of information that SpaghettiOs left out on the floor for what looks to be like over a month is not appetizing anymore. And it made his room stink. Who would have fucking guessed? I'm getting ready for my first ever date. Get ready with me, guys. After playing with my favorite little roach, I call her Maeve. She's Queen Maeve. She's also pregnant, too. So I'm taking good care of her, making sure she's fed. I'm just... I'm gonna skip over the cockroach part for now. He also has a weird obsession with letting coffee just mold and foam and, uh, turn chunky. If that makes sense, that's like the best way that I can even explain this. Also, I need a new creamer for my coffee that doesn't mold as quickly because it molds too fast. I can't save it for later and continue drinking. Yeah, I also really hate when the coffee that I left out in the prehistoric era all of a sudden turned moldy in 2023. God damn it. I think the most surprising thing about this entire situation is how many girls he's getting to come over to his house. I don't know if it's voluntary, but he's he's having girls in his room. I can't wait to bring this girl home. I'm gonna put her on that chair. We're gonna play some League of Legends together. It's gonna be so much fun. Wish me luck on my date, guys. Why the fuck does this chair look like when Spider-Man is being overtaken by Venom? There is no amount of money in this world that will convince me to put my ass in that fucking chair. Why is it molding? How does that even happen? What, what causes it? What? Top Roach fun facts that you didn't know about that I found out from roaches living in my room. Yep, so I'm gonna end the video here. Uh, we're done watching cockroaches. Please, for the love of God, do not send this guy hate. I'm assuming this is all satire. Uh, if it's not, then go see Dr. Phil or Oprah or someone. Go get help, dude. There's no way you live like this. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, like, subscribe. Much appreciated if you do. I'm, I'm gonna go vomit.